How's your early Echo summon, guys? Are you happy with it? Before we go on the details about this summon event, for our friends that still have no idea about this Echo and what's the use of it, this is practically the character gears in Wuthering Waves which you can equip to strengthen your characters. So, to build your characters, you need Echoes and put it on your character's Echo slots. While you wait for the official release of the game, why not try this web event and get an early access to one of the 5-star Echo? There are three types of Echoes based on their cost, 1, 3, and 4. From this event, you can get a 5-star rarity up to cost 3. So now the question is, did you get a 5-star Echo with cost 3 from your summons? If not, that's okay. You can redeem and have the chance to obtain additional 5-star Echoes from the shared Echo gift cards of other players. Here are some Echoes you would like to redeem from me. The good thing is having an early 5-star Echo is very useful to one of our characters in our early days in playing the game. It will probably be added to our databank terminal level. What's this databank terminal? It is where your absorbed Echo goes into. There will be a datadoc info that will show your current Echo collection progress. Basically, it will show your chance of getting a higher rarity Echo and the cost limit. You can increase your terminal level by capturing more Echoes and unlocking new types of Echoes, so this early 5-star is for sure useful. From CBT2, you need to get to level 15 data terminal to get a 5-star rarity Echo drop, so having one from this event is great. Just to be clear, that the chosen Echo from this event will have two fixed substats, and the main stats and the other substats upon tuning will still be random. If you plan to equip this early 5-star Echo to your attacker, you would like to get an elemental damage bonus on the main stats of the chosen cost 3 echo. Based on my experience in CBT2, here are the echoes that I think are very rare. I can remember my pain farming for at least one 5 star echo rarity of it. It's still up to you which echo you choose. Choosing any 5 star echo with cost 3, with possible sonata effects applicable to the attributes of the attacker you want, is also a good option. But what the hell is this sonata effects? Sonata effects are basically your set bonuses. Set bonuses are achieved by either getting two of the onset pieces or five of the onset pieces. For example, if you have equipped two Void Thunder Echo pieces, you will get a 10% increase in electro damage. If you have five Void Thunder Echo pieces, you will get a 15% increase in electro damage after using your heavy attack or resonance skill. And this effect can stack up to two times, which means an easy 30% increase in electro damage check out the link from the description to know more about Sonata effects. From this event, the Sonata effects of your chosen 5-star Echo will be from the 2 or 3 possible Sonata effects. I am hoping that it matches the attribute of the character you intend to equip it with. Before I forgot, Cost 4 Echo are from World Boss that have the crit stats, which you can farm in the game. You can equip Echoes with a total cost of 12 across all 5 slots of your character. The most optimal build for a 5 on sets pieces could be 4, 3, 3, 1, 1 cost. The cost 4 will be your main boss slot Echo, and it is usually placed in the Echo ability slot where you can use during combat or explorations. What I experienced using in CBT2 for most of my resonators is putting 4, 4, 3, and 1, but it will only be 2 of the onset pieces plus another 2 set pieces. So really, good luck on our Echo farming. Moving on, this event will give you more rewards from Echo Gallery. So, to get all those rewards you need to complete daily missions and special missions like sharing, redeeming Echo gift cards, and inviting your friends to pre-register on the game. The event is until June 6, so you will get all the rewards if you do the missions. All the rewards will be issued via mailbox when you reach Union Level 8, or until July 3. Make sure you reach Union Level 8 before that. And, reminder guys, choose the right server and the rover you want. Then lock your chosen Echo so you can reserve it before the end of the event. I really hope this helps. We already reached 24.4 million mark pre-registration. 30 million and 20 free standard pulls is waving to us rovers. Please subscribe and smash the like button if you like this video. As always, thank you for watching.